We're on the south coast in Bournemouth, at the head of the CIS, which is the Coastal Interceptor Sewer, uh, where we are carrying out renovation works to repair the structurally damaged sewer. The sewer here in Bournemouth has been damaged by acid corrosion, which is a byproduct of hydrogen sulfide being released from the sewage. We've used the latest BIM technology to locate the sewer underground and um, we managed to sink a shaft within 50 mil of the side of the sewer. The sewer rehab team have been involved in this project right from the start through the optioneering detailed design and we've followed the construction works at project manager level. We are uh, carrying out renovation works on the sewer and associated manholes, um, removing any damaged concrete we're lining 200 metres of the tunnel with GRP liners and um, we're carrying out lining of the associated manholes with calcium alumina cement, which is a new product for the water industry. Calcium alumina cement has the advantage of a greater resistance to hydrogen sulphide attack. Um, down to a pH of 3.5, the calcium alumina cement forms a gel layer on its surface which uh, resists the acid. We've spent a lot of time researching it um, in collaboration with Sydney Water Australia um, and we're the first water company in the UK to use this product to line a sewer. We're looking to remove some of the energy from the sewage and, and reduce the turbulence as it's the turbulence that releases the hydrogen sulphide gas and causes corrosion of the structural asset. To remove this energy we're using um, an energy dissipating vortex the technology for the energy dissipating vortex was originally invented by the predecessors of Wessex Water, Bristol City Council, back in the 1950s. During our time at Seafield Road, we've kept customers informed to minimise disruption to them. We've used uh, letter drops to the local residents and for any times we're working at the weekend, we've been sending out text messages. We are preserving the life of the structural asset, the tunnel, um, up to 200 years.